To hell with doing my goodbyes too early. I want my moment with Dr. Cox, and I want it now. Dr. Cox, since this is my last day, I got you a little something, you know, as a thank you, because in my mind, you're the one who made me the man I am today. You can't blame me for that. No, that's too mean. It's a book of all your rants. I always wrote them down. Wow. Check it out. Pleather bound, I did the calligraphy. The number next to each passage is a rating system from one to five, depending on how much that particular rant hurt me emotionally. One being something I could easily shrug off, and five being something that still makes me want to cut myself. Oh, look. The only way you could be less productive right now is if you were, in fact, the wall on which you're leaning against. That one used to be a five, but now it's a four. I still well up when I think about it, but now I can fall asleep after. Who wants to see what Jordan does when she's bored? Hey, newbie. What if, say, I wanted to locate something in here about just how little I care about any given moment that you and I have spent together? Good question. You just go to the glossary, ah. and you see how little I care. Page 19. Boom. Page turn. Things I care as little about as J.D.'s last day of residency. <laughs> I remember this one. Oh, every hybrid car, every talk show host, everything on the planet, everything in the solar system, and everything, 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 everything that exists past, present, and future in all discovered and undiscovered dimensions, and of course, Hugh Jackman. Oh, that was nice. I like that we shared that. Me too, because it's the exact sentiment that I wanted to put out there for you on your last day of work here. Thank you for this lovely present. It's okay, um, you're welcome. 